Welcome to Mental Health Tips for All Enneagram Types. Today we're going to be talking about Enneagram Type 6s. Sixes are often referred to as the loyalist and they are master troubleshooters. They can foresee problems ahead of others and they can put an action plan together to help those potentially at risk. As their title suggests, they are also very loyal and committed to the people and things that they value. So if you want a committed friend, then find yourself an Enneagram Six. Sixes have a strong desire for safety. They frequently think about and prepare for what could go wrong in the various situations of their lives. That way of living can be exhausting and it can cause a lot of anxiety for sixes. So the first mental health tip for sixes is to learn some breathing exercises and to practice them regularly, daily if possible. Breathing exercises will help calm your body down, lessen the power of the fearful thoughts and help ground you into the present moment rather than allowing your mind to race about all the things that could go wrong. Some popular breathing exercises are 5-5-5 breathing and 4-7-8 breathing, among others. And if you're a Christian, you should try breath prayers. Breath prayers are a little foreign to Christians living in the West, but they are a great way to both calm your body down while also praying and speaking biblical truths. Progressive muscle relaxation techniques can also be helpful in alleviating anxiety and helping you feel more relaxed as well. I'll drop some links below to some breathing exercises, breath prayers, and progressive muscle relaxation techniques. So definitely check those out. Now it's time for the second mental health tip for Enneagram Sixes. Prominent Enneagram coach and author Tyler Zock said that Sixes would benefit by asking themselves this question, what's the best that could happen? This is a big perspective shift for Sixes because it's the exact opposite of fear-based thinking. Rather than thinking of all the things that could go wrong in a relationship or a situation, ask yourself, what's the best that could happen? What could go right? It probably won't be natural at first, but if you can get in the habit of asking yourself that question, you'll notice that anxiety and thoughts that used to cripple you in fear will begin to have less and less power over you. And that is always excellent for your mental health. So there it is, mental health tips for Enneagram Sixes. If this video has been helpful, then please hit that subscribe button and bell icon. Thanks guys.